Hi, I'm Dave Kovacic, Director of Technical Service for Bay State Milling Company. Today we're here at the Rothwell Grain Essential Center to talk about incorporating whole grains into your pizza dough formula. The health benefits of incorporating whole grain, like reduced rates of heart disease and improved weight management, are well documented. However, there's still a lot of people that don't like the taste or texture of whole grain. One way to provide the health benefits, but not overall your formula completely, is to incorporate small amounts of whole grains. A crust with whole, some whole grains will appeal to more health conscious customers. I recommend easing into whole grains by replacing just 5 to 10 percent of your refined white flour with whole wheat flour. You can increase the amount over time. From a production standpoint, incorporating whole grains is simple. There's no new technologies or processes, just simple formula or process adjustments. Start by looking at your white flour. If it has enough strength and tolerance, it should be able to handle the small percentage of whole wheat flour that you're adding. If you consider adding more whole wheat flour, you may want to consider a stronger flour. We're using a formula with our Winona Patton flour. This flour has excellent mixing and fermentation tolerance, making it an ideal for incorporating whole grains. Whole wheat flour will absorb more water than white flour, but at a slower rate. I recommend you increase your water absorption by 1% for every 10% of whole wheat flour that you use. As for production adjustments, slower mixing speeds and longer mixing times may be necessary. This is due to the diluting effect of the gluten forming proteins and the slower rate of hydration of the whole wheat flour. Adjustments will be based on how much whole wheat flour you're using and the strength of your white flour. Just using a small percentage of whole wheat flour shouldn't change your bake times or your temperatures. Bay State Milling has a wide array of whole grain baking flours that can be incorporated into your pizza dough. The first option is our Grain Essentials White Whole Wheat Extra Fine Flour. It has the same taste, appearance, and performance of refined white flour. The reduced particle size produces a smooth textured crust. You can also incorporate a traditional whole wheat flour, like our Wingold whole wheat. This flour is milled to precise granulations and provides all the health benefits of whole grain. Another way to incorporate whole grains is with our Grain Essentials Easy Grain Pizza Dough Mix. Aside from its 53% whole grain, it's very easy to use. All you do is add water and yeast. This pizza will also appeal to customers looking to eat healthy, and it also meets the school lunch program guidelines. Another way to appeal to health conscious consumers is by incorporating the latest trend, and that's sprouted whole wheat flour. Our Benegrain sprouted whole wheat flour is available in both conventional and organic. It offers improved flavor and can easily be incorporated into your current pizza dough. Today we took our Winona Patton flour and incorporated 10% of the Benegrain sprouted whole wheat flour. You can see a slight variation in color, but the performance of the flour was exactly the same. The flavor will be very similar, but with the added benefits of whole grain. Thanks for joining us here at the Rothwell Grain Essential Center for our discussion on whole grain flours. To learn more, go to baystatemilling.com.